Why? Why do you knock? I want to know what's in that door. Wait, I gotta use your phone. Is it here? No, it's not here. Where's that? Where's your phone? Look at that. They're gonna sit there and talk. Yo, if you just connect me to like your phone, that'd be amazing. Cause I don't know where it is. All right, I'm not gonna get lost here looking for the phone. Move, Patowski. It has to be in here. Oh, it's right there. Wow, I knew it. I went. That's the first place I went. Operator, message for KGPL. Putting you through now. Phelps, one two four seven. What can I help you, detective? It's not like the same person. How can I help, detective? Any messages? Just one detective from the coroner. Message reads: Phelps, see me at Central Morgue immediately. Results of the Patterson autopsy. Thanks for your help. Like, are you serious? That sounds like the same person. Move, my man. I'm trying to go through. Here we go. Where's that car? Here's that ugly ass black car. Matches my black suit. With red tie. Let's go to Sheldon. Let's go to get that mother there for that hit, that piece of shit dude. Let's go. Straighten up and fly right. Oh, I'm singing so you won't hear the lyrics. Are we not gonna talk? Alright, we're already here. Boom, let's wait for his mother effort. Look at that, his hand, he's so tall, he goes through the car. Get a little bit shorter, dude. Oh my god, we waited three hours. How the hell am I still up? I would've been tired. I'm like, I'm done. That's the son of a bitch right there. William Shelton? Yes. It doesn't look good, Sheldon. You packing your bag? Ho ho ho, Sheldon! Good luck from dude from two and a half men. And making a run for it, you know why we're here. Yes. The accident. We've got witnesses who can put this car at the scene, not to mention the physical damage. This is open and shut, Sheldon. Why would you catch it, dude? Are you serious? Like, what would give you? Maybe it's just reactions, but... That coward thinks he can run from everything. Let's go. One, two, three. Look at that. He turns right. Move, my dude. Oh, look. I, I got damaged now because that dude didn't want to move. Let's go. I'm going to get this dude. Wow, are you serious? Did not turn whatsoever. The car just kept on going straight. Look, he's going to get away from me. Not in my watch. Look, that dude's running away. He must have done something too. Let's go get him. Stop that. I was hearing it before and it was getting annoying. I was like, oh my god. How can anyone listen to that? Let's go. He killed someone driving like this. Let's go get him. Come on. Shoot him in the tire. Oh no. Let that asshole get away. Oh, you gotta shoot him in the tire, my man? This is not why we, this is why we get guns. Oh my god, I, I hit him. He should be done. Time for the count. No. Oh. Time for the count. Take it right, take it right. There you go. Yeah, you helped me, car. Ugh. Stop running away. You know you're gonna get hit. Oh, what the what the hell's wrong with you? I gotta warn people. I warned them. I warned them. I did my job as a duty man. He ain't getting away. Head into the station. Go on. Get after it. Wow, nice, nice car. Hold it right there, Shelton. Let's get him. supposed to like get in that what the hell was he doing he was like waiting for me yeah oh that's how I do fall vehicular manslaughter rap sound Shelton I hit him I admit it I just panicked but it wasn't my fault what do you mean the guy jumped right out in front of me he came out of nowhere there's nothing I could do about it why didn't you stop I've had accidents before that's it we're done here the DA is gonna love you. They weren't all my fault. I'm a surveyor. I need my license for my job. There were people around. A woman and a man were standing right next to him. I thought they could get him to a hospital. 
I'm telling you, it's not my fault. The guy is dead, Sheldon. You can't be serious. William Shelton, you're coming downtown. We need to talk about a manslaughter charge. Whoo! Looks like the dude from Two and a Half Man wasn't gonna make it. He ain't gonna make it. I'll drive, I'll drive, my man. You do too much, Potowski. Okay. Let's go to the Central Morgue. Go! How close is that? How close is that? Let's see how close. No, nope, it's really far. That is really far, and the thing is right there. Nope, it's not happening. Sorry, the officers are gonna have to die. Wow, no! Don't you dare do it, trolley! I blame the trolley on that one. Can't blame me. Can't blame me on that one. The trolley came out of nowhere. I'm gonna use the same excuse Sheldon used. There you go. Those ambulance on the morgue. Where'd we park our car? Door there. Open the door. We're mad. Has that just been paid? Look about. Let me talk to this dude. Keep talking. Someday you'll say something what do you intelligent. Think? What's happening here? Can I not talk to the janitor? This town is going straight to hell. Any ideas? Man, if the full report will go into the case file, but Carruthers could probably give you what he has now. We can put the drive yeah, I don't need this super task game. Already in there. You'd be making a big mistake. Run that by me again? The victim was dead before the car hit him. Two puncture wounds to the right side of the thorax. Second puncture reached his heart. You're kidding me. Been doing this job 23 years, son. No one's ever laughed at one of my jokes. He was stabbed to <laughs> death. Long, sharp knife. Length of a bayonet. We found a knife in the alleyway. Where is it now? Was it bagged? I'm pretty sure it was bagged. I told him I left with the bag here. Was it bagged? By Patrolman Kaplan. Perfect. I'll get you a definite match. Jesus, we got him. Murder one. We were right there and they tried to stare us down. Now they'll both get the gas chamber. We have the knife, we have the coroner's report, and I bet we could roll Sabo as a witness. Let's bring her in. Who the hell is Sabo? I, I, we just played this game, and I'm literally confused who Sabo is. I'm gonna suck the hell out of you. Is, is it that dude? The bartender, the girl. What am I doing? Shut up! Who the hell was just bark? Not barking, honking at my ass. I do whatever it takes, my man. Excuse me. You hit me. This is the cop car. Oh, look at me. Bam. I do whatever I want. Let's go. No conversation. This like must be the shortest case ever. This conversation is like amazing how we just don't talk. We'll be like, yeah. Left. Coming up. All right, cool. We'll be like, yeah, nice weather. Well, you know, we're cops. You're like, yeah. We can talk about, I don't know, how, how this, not murder, how this dude killed his dude, killed his wife, you know? Or, nah, the wife killed his son. Uh, you know what, I'm just gonna be quiet. Let's just listen to the road. Listen to the road. I ain't gonna stop here, come on. Come on, I don't listen to the rules. I'm a cop. I am above the law. Boom, just missed her. Bam. Let's go up the thing. Knock on the door. And be like, you're under arrest. We spoke to the coroner, Mrs. Patterson. He confirmed your husband's cause of death. We'd like you to come downtown and answer some questions. It wasn't me. It was Leroy's idea. Leroy stabbed him. I had nothing to do with it. Where is Leroy now? He's in the bedroom. You're very good, Lorna. Put the gun down, Leroy. If you do something stupid now, you don't stand a chance in front of the grand jury. Nice of you to give me up, sweetheart. All that whispering in my ear telling me how he had to get rid of him, how good it could be, all the money we could claim, all that planning, 
how to get him into the street, how to make it look like an accident. For God's sake, you Leroy, all shut the up! You have covered, baby. I have nothing to do you with it. You think I'm gonna fry for you, He's Lorna? He's a crazy man. Shoot him! Shoot him, for God's sake! Oh, no, she's dead. Too bad I really didn't care that much. Too bad. Maybe I should have cared. Maybe... Look, how's it one now? It was three. Jump forward, Cole. Are you serious? Ah, got pushed to the floor. Oh, you ran. Ran away. Oh, does this dude trick my ass? I... Where the hell is he going? Sabo, stop or I will shoot. Oh, this dude tricked me real bad. Thought he was gonna take that right. Took a. He still went straight. Boom! Look at me. No, you're not gonna get away with this. Ah, you got away. No. Oh, did he get away? Hey, hey, hey. Oh my god, he got away, didn't he? No, he's right here. I didn't even go that way, but whatever. You come any closer and I will pull the trigger. Put the weapon down now. Put your weapons down and your hands in the air. Right. What if I shoot his arm? You want me to paint the fucking sidewalk? <laughs> Help me! Boom! I shot him twice just to make sure that first one didn't get him. You look spooked, Phelps. I thought you'd been under fire before. It never gets any easier, Bukowski. He has one, but I shot him twice. I think I shot him in the head. Like, come on. You ain't getting a grave. You staying down where you are. So, I give you a hit and run. You bring me back fraud, conspiracy, and first degree murder. This is how a good detective operates, Phelps. You take nothing at face value. You keep digging and asking questions until you get to the truth. You got some sharp elbows on you, detective. I like that. Keep up the good work. If you shot someone, like, right in front of the... Do I get five stars? That wasn't my fault. That wasn't my fault either. Yes! Five stars! Another visit to Ray and you would have seen what Leroy was prepared to do to avoid jail. I have never understood that. I've never understood that case, no. There's literally nothing else I could do after that. But you know what? I'm not here to judge. I'm just here to be like, you know what, Leroy? You're gonna die. Let's go throw back Thursday. Well, we're going to war already. My family runs a shipping business in San Francisco. We used to have two ships a week to Tokyo. We've been in shipping for two generations, Hank. There you go. You were going to do it right on it, were you? Huh? You're so smart. Oh, my bad. I've never been on a voyage anywhere. I feel like Odysseus in the beginning of his journey. The Odyssey took ten years, Cole. This is the American century. America can rule the world after we win this war. We need to stay alive, Cole. These men are counting on us. If you're what the veterans are saying to each other? No. Golden Gate in 48. That's four more hard years of fighting. I don't even know what the hell that means. I mean, like, 1952? Because I'm pretty sure 48 was the, the year... World War II was over. 